Dr. Bet, Chief of Sire Livestock and Cooperatives in your county. Um, our department, part of our mandate is disease control and public health. The major challenge we are facing at the moment is fighting the disease called rabies. Rabies is a viral disease which affects all warm blooded animals, which means uh, dogs, human beings, so we call it a zoonotic disease, meaning it affects humans as well as animals. The, at the moment, we rabies as a disease is mainly transmitted by dogs. Dogs are the main carriers and transmitters of the disease through bites. Usually a dog which is infected with rabies will behave differently. It becomes wild or sometimes they become uh, paralyzed. So the wild form is where they attack all manner of things including humans, other animals, um, so th the infection is through a bite and because the disease is nervous so the disease comes through saliva <coughs> infected saliva if it gets in, in contact with a wound will also infect either humans or other animals so the target then becomes we need to vaccinate the dog or we need to control the population of dogs either by keeping them at home and having them vaccinated. At the moment in Kirijo County, we are experiencing a surge in cases of rabies. We've had cases in Chaplanget in Bureti, in Litain, uh, Kabianga in Belgut, Kapsaos, and uh, parts of Soin Sigawit. We managed to do to carry out vaccinations two months ago in Soin what so in Sigawet, but the cases have continued to rise and uh, as a department we've managed to procure 40,000 doses of rabies vaccine and we've started the vaccination serious vaccinations at the moment we have covered 10,000 animals when I say animals we are covering sheep and goats we're covering cows and we're also covering the dogs I want to appreciate the people of Kabianga the people of uh, Kapsaos Ward, they have turned out in large numbers. That is the vaccination we've been doing the last two weeks. And the program pro program is ongoing. We'll be completing this program in Kapsaos tomorrow, Friday. And then now we've planned countywide programs to carry out vaccinations against rabies. I want to urge farmers to turn out, to bring their animals. The county government, through the governor, His Excellency Dr. Mutai, has allowed us to subsidize this vaccination. So we are doing it 100% subsidized. The vaccination for dogs, for cats, for donkeys, cows, sheep and goats is currently ongoing. The point is we want to help lower the levels of rabies in our county. We know it's a very dangerous disease. We've lost two school-going children to rabies and we've lost about 15 cows in the last two months. That is a big loss. A loss of any human is too much a loss to bear. Um, so that is why the, gov the county government has fully subsidized the vaccination. So I want to urge all our farmers to turn out in big numbers to carry out uh, a cover for their animals. Um, the signs of rabies, I've said in, 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 in dogs, can either be paralytic or it can be very aggressive. So you'll find a dog will stray from home, it will bite any animal. When you encounter such an animal, we have to ask the public, please report. Number one is to report. Report to the nearest uh, administration, because we know through the administration that we will get these cases reported to us.